a life that was uh, cut way too short. Chaplain Nick Velicides is talking about the life of Robert Orlando, the 17-year-old who was killed in a car accident just a day before his senior year of high school. This family just lives a, a few hundred yards from my home. My daughter's the same age. They used to walk to school together. So it's just one of our own. We've lost, we've lost one of our own. Tuesday, a funeral mass was held in memory of Robert. Family and friends were there, accompanied by hundreds of teenagers, Robert's former classmates. The 17-year-old had been on the golf team and was an avid fisherman. In fact, he was on his way back from a fishing trip when a friend crashed into a tree, an accident that proved fatal for Robert. Well, you can imagine how the family is doing. This is your worst nightmare come true. So they're, they're, they're grappling with uh, what the future looks like. They're a great family, very gracious and kind and loving, and they're surrounded by a lot of good friends and family, so I have no doubt that they will, they will find a new normal, but it, it's gonna be a painful pro process. I wasn't able to speak with Robert's family on Tuesday at the funeral mass, but I did speak with his mother last week, who at the time was trying to describe her son, but the words only led to tears. In San Ramon, J.R. Stone, Cron 4 News.